By now, all of us know how to find the cube of a number. So 3 when cubed gives us 27. It means 3 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 3 equals 27. So what is a cube root? Well, the cube root of 27 is 3. That's all. This is the most important concept of cube roots. The rest of the video will just focus on how cube roots are denoted and its application. So remember, 3 cubed is 27 and cube root of 27 is 3. Well, this is how the symbol of a cube root looks like. A root sign with a 3 here. So we can say that the cube root of 27 is 3. And as we saw in the square root video, this root sign is called the radical. And the number inside it is called the radicand or the base. Here's a better way to understand the concept of cubes. 4 cubed equals 4 times 4 times 4, which equals 64. We all know this. This 3, when taken to the other side, becomes cube root. Hence, we can say that the cube root of 64 equals 4. Now, we're on our way to understand a very interesting concept. We will try to understand this concept with just one example. We know that cube root of 64 is 4. This example looks very simple, but modifying it slightly can make it interesting. Let's play with these numbers. We can write 64 as 2 raised to 6. Hence, cube root of 64 can be written as cube root of 2 raised to 6. We can also write 64 as 4 cubed. Hence, we write this as cube root of 4 cubed. Now let's try writing 4 in an exponential form. 4 can be written as 2 squared. Hence, this would equal 2 squared. And of course, it can also be written as 4 raised to 1. What do we observe? Yes, when we take a cube root of a number in exponential form, the base remains the same and the exponent is divided by 3. 6 became 2 and 3 became 1. Remember, when we take a cube root of a number in exponential form, we should keep the base same and divide the exponent by 3. Let's quickly look at a couple of examples. Say we want to find the cube root of 4 raised to 9. The base actually equals 262,144. Imagine finding the cube root of this big number. But using our technique, all we need to do is keep the base same and divide the exponent by 3. Here the base is 4, hence we write a 4 here, and divide 9 by 3. Hence we get the cube root of 4 raised to 9 as 4 raised to 3. Now let's try finding the cube root of 7 raised to 6. We can write it as 7 raised to 6 by 3 which equals 7 raised to 2. So remember, keep the base same and divide the exponent by 3. In the coming videos, we will see how we can calculate the cube root of large numbers which are not in exponential form.